Well, here we are in the Bahamas. The lighthouse with the sun rising makes it a little tough to see, but. All right, so there we are here at the island. Nice little lighthouse there. Boy, I'll tell you guys, I didn't realize, but my lens is getting so steamy because it's so humid right now. It looks like it's already getting steamed up again. Wow. Okay, so there it is. Ocean Key, MSC Marine Reserve. So this place actually used to be a industrial sand excavation and they've turned it into a marine reserve here in the Bahamas. That's pretty cool, right? Um, so tourism making eco work. Yeah, for sure. So your rental and excursion pavilion over there. And so that is uh, great if you want to go see like a shipwreck or uh, maybe take you to a private snorkeling area. Um, we decided not to do any excursions because we we're just looking to be more chill. Yeah, and there it is, the ship behind us. Okay, well we're ready to rock and roll this place here. Yeah, so this is so cute. They have this nice little walkway with their little touristy kind of shops here. And there's a little harbor here for the excursion boats. Ooh, they even rent jet skis over there. Wow, how about that? Yeah, little housing over there. Man, this is really cool. Nice little coconut tree. Man, I'm loving the island life. Island life, loving it. <laughs> I just love this, so great. So here's the island. Um, yeah, and we're gonna walk out our way out to the, uh, I think Bimini Beach is where we're gonna go. You can see we're at the little star right there. So we're heading out to Bimini Beach. Nice little cove. We're on this little bridge here. On this bridge, the, out to the ocean. This bridge takes you over to this other little island to where we're going. Pretty sweet. All right, well, so this island here, Ocean Key, is fantastic. And the, so if I'm to uh, evaluate, you know, uh, Norwegian Cruise Lines versus MSC, uh, I would say right now the boat for NCL is nicer. Um, the you know the interior is more taken care of. The service is a little bit better. But now when you go to their uh, Bahama Island, they have to tender you in. And when we went on our trip, the the seas were rough and they weren't able to tender us in. So we weren't actually able to stay uh, at the island. Now here MSC they have their own dock port where we just pulled in, and then you have this beautiful beautiful island um, so I'm assuming that even in rougher seas they could pull this boat in here and, and that would be an advantage for sure because this island is fantastic some paddle boarders they made their way all the way from that side that beach over there and they just went all the way across paddle boarding across just enjoying the the wind is at their back so they're loving it hopefully they don't have to go back <laughs> <laughs> okay, not sure if that's a Coast Guard in, in Utah, that would be Life Flight. But it's more of an orange. In, in Utah, that would be more like a red. That's more like an orange, but it's so cool. Fly all the way here from Miami or what? I'm not sure. So much fun those the water is just like crystal clear and there's these little needle fish and uh, boy I don't even know what those other fish are but they were all over the place guys started feeding them bread and 
Um, I kind of got the camera out there after that, but hopefully I got some great shots. I'll look at that later. But it sure was cool. They were jumping around my head and it was just, my goodness, it was so much fun. So this area right here where the rocks are, you see some people out there on the end of the rocks and you go all the way around the rocks over there into that other bay, bay area. And there's a little jetty over there and some more rocks and that's just a great area. I saw, a, I saw a gigantic barracuda, I'm not kidding. The thing was maybe three feet long, it was huge. And my camera, my GoPro had run out of batteries. Of course, right? It only, it's the way it always happens, right? <laughs> Is it on play? Oh no. Or is the batteries out? Oh yeah, whatever, right? So, but it, it was amazing. Um, also, Stingray was out there, so lots of cool things to see. Did I get those on video? No, but a lot of cool things did end up on video, and loving this place. It's so beautiful. Yeah, you know, and I've heard people say, oh, I've been to the Bahamas, I won't go back. Whatever, I'd come back here. This place is sweet. It's very peaceful. The water is amazing. It's crystal clear. Look at this blue out here. Look at that blue. It's absolutely amazing. It's like turquoise. There's, I mean, and it's crystal clear when you're walking into it right there. It is fantastic. Well, guys, so we were all the way over there on the far side of the island. You can see the mast of the um, I think it's a catamaran sailboat over there and uh, then you can see over there that little inlet there's a lagoon in the middle of these um, two islands here there's an island over there on the far side and then this big one here and then there's a lagoon in there and in, in the entrance of that lagoon that's where I saw probably about a three foot barracuda which I got it on the video but that's where it was um, like every fish story right no really I'm serious it was um, <laughs> so there's a beach up there, there's the lighthouse, they're supposed to have um, a light show on the lighthouse tonight, we'll see if I can get that tonight, that'll be cool. And uh, a party down there, not sure what that's going to be like, but yeah, this is Ocean Key.